It's literally completely RNG whether the golem decides to get in between me and her or not. That's literally what it comes down to. It's such bad design. I know that they f probably figure that, you know, majority of the player base isn't even going to experience this. They're just going to write it off as being really hard. Fucking Christ, dude. You do not know how much bullshit that I've gone through fighting this boss. I don't even feel excited. I just feel relieved. At this point, I literally don't even feel like, woohoo, like, yay. Like, I'm just like, fucking finally, dude. I've switched a couple things around, like with my aspects over the course of doing the fight. But this is what works for me. You know, different, putting different aspects, or putting different aspects on different pieces of gear. Like, I wound up putting the blighted on the, the necklace because I still need the frenzy dead because my minions need the attack speed. Because I don't have the attack speed like on other pieces of gear. Like, I don't have it on the gloves or on certain other pieces where I could get more attack speed and then maybe sacrifice this but that's what I went with for this show the book of the dead real quick pretty much the same thing everybody's using I thought that the forming a corpse thing would be really good because sometimes you do feel like you need more corpses against the hand aerial but the cooldown is just so good for slamming with the golem then we got the shadow mages and then we have the blood golem here's my skill tree right here i pretty much used a max roll build guide i'll just put the planner in the description the only thing really different i'll put the planner in a pinned comment as well the only thing really different just which aspects I put where and that's just from playing and doing the boss fight and seeing like what seems to work better for me okay so let me talk about this fight I know my green screen's all fucked up it's starting to get dark outside I put a lamp on it makes me look red as hell this fight shows some of the issues with the game like the little there's little electric orbs on the ground those orbs sometimes hit you when they don't even really hit you. They're hitting you server side, but they're not hitting you on client side. You clearly dodged it. I believe it's because we're constantly at 70 ping. Some people say that it's due to the hitboxes, but I don't think it's the hitboxes because it's like sometimes you dodge it, sometimes you don't. If it was the hitboxes, I feel like it would always hit you within a certain radius. Like, even if it's not technically hitting you. So that's my thoughts on that. The fight overall was not designed with minions. It's designed with you having full constitution over your character. It's designed with you being able to fight and dodge, not having to have your minion or your golem attacking an enemy and then turning their back for God knows why. Just wasting precious time in the middle of the fight. At the very end of the fight, even if you've gotten no debuff stacks, you essentially get one-shotted by Uber Lilith. She hits you with some attack, and then it's like you're not even getting hit. It must be damage over time that gets applied by it, because it doesn't kill you right away, but then you just drop dead. Because when she hits you, she applies damage over time, I believe, and she applies the debuff at the very, at the very end, just with her regular attacks. So she hits you... 
and you just you just dead at the very end of the fight if your if your golem doesn't get in between you and her and keep her from getting to you you're dead i played this fight a bunch of different times and it just it's satisfying to finally get it done but also it was really annoying and i would suggest if you're going to do it master work your gear up higher mine are only at like level six or something like that so i need to spend some more time in the pit that's probably also why i'm having some trouble with dps in the pit because my gear isn't master worked as high as i probably should have it to push further but this kind of goes back to the whole thing with the game being a systems arpg and you kind of have to overcome the fact that there's one shots just by dpsing better because it's at a point where no matter how much your defenses are stacked up damage reduction everything it doesn't matter at a certain point at a certain point you're better suited to just doing more damage taking the boss out quicker even skipping phases and stuff so with all that said <clears throat> i think it was like a cool fight but i think that some of the damage aspects are overtuned when the fact that my character is getting one-shotted without having any debuff stacks and i have forty thousand health like that shouldn't be happening that's forty thousand health without a potion so once i popped that other potion and shit i got like fifty thousand health or something and then if i have fortify that's equivalent to a hundred thousand health basically so i don't know it's just honestly really annoying in my opinion 